Hey, hi, hello, and welcome to the video. Today is December 1st, and I'm going to be recommending Christmassy books. As you can tell, I'm decorated and ready because I love Christmas. So I'm going to be recommending a few books for you to read to get into the holiday spirit. And first on our list is The Fat Man, A Tale of North Pole Noor by Ken Harmon. I love this book, I actually read it every holiday season. It is a story about an elf that is unlike any other elf. He's, he's got an attitude and he drinks and it's great. And he goes through a wild ride and it's, it's a kind of a murder mystery. And I love murder mysteries and I love Christmas. And this just, this was right up my alley. Another cool thing about this book is there's like a lot of uh, traditional holiday Christmassy characters that you see like a different side of and some of them are just downright crazy and this book just it just gets me in the Christmassy mood I love it next I have up for you a merry little murder it's a Linda Haggerty story written by Shelley Freydent or Freydont or Frydont I could be pronouncing it wrong I actually picked this book up at the library in the summer. I saw the title, thought it was hilarious, had to take it home and read it. Didn't realize it was part of a series, but you know what? I didn't need the series to, to love the book and love the murder mystery and love the hotel they were in. And it's basically, you are um, like Linda Haggerty. She's kind of a detective and she's got a man friend who's like, you know, a man friend. And, um, <laughs> I don't know how to say this without spoiling it. Someone dies, obviously, and uh, they're at this hotel and there's all these people and they got to figure it out. It was fun to read. I had a blast with it. Um, my library had it in regular font and large print font for those of us with uh, spectacles. So I recommend it just because it's hilarious. Uh, it's fun and there's murder. There's a theme here. Next I have up for you, Boom, Nosferatu by Joe Hill. If you're like me and you love Christmas, but you also love really scary shit, sorry, crap, are there children watching? There's a place in this book called Christmas Land. Christmas Land. And it's unlike any other Christmas Land you will ever visit. If you're like me and you love Christmas and love really, really spooky crap and scary crap and just all kinds of just death and murder and that sounds bad, doesn't it? But if you like that kind of stuff and if you've read Joe Hill stuff before and you haven't read this yet, reading it during Christmas time will just kind of hit your heart a little different than if you read it any other time of the year. I highly recommend to read it around Christmas. Next up for you, I have Bah Humbug by Heather Horrocks. Horrocks? Horrocks? I think it's Horrocks. <laughs> this is actually a really cute sort of like romance thing. There's this like really frustrated writer who's like Bah Humbug, hence the title. And um, this like TV personality who loves Christmas and loves the holiday season and they meet and eventually they fall in love obviously because that's like the point of a romance but it's just it's really wholesome and very Christmassy and I absolutely adored it and last but not least we have The Snowman by Raymond Briggs and it is the sweetest most adorable with the most beautiful illustrations Christmassy book ever I think personally you could go through this book, look through it, be with it, love it, all of it, no matter what age you are. If you have kids, you can have story time with them. If you don't have kids, you can have story time with yourself. It is a book that will get you into the festive feels. At least it does for me. I will say that I really want to read In a Holidays by Christina Lauren before Christmas, if I can get it. I get most of my books from the library, so I'm on a waiting list. <laughs> but if I read that anytime before Christmas, I will do a video about it in this sweater because this is my Christmas sweater. 
I live in a hot climate. I don't even need it, but here I am. So I hope you read something Christmassy, whether it's one of the books I recommended or not. Get into the holiday feels. And if you don't celebrate Christmas, I mean, this, this is, this is just hilarious. This just, this is good. Like, you know. <laughs> well, that's it for me. I hope everyone has a good morning, afternoon, evening, night, whatever time zone you're in. Have a good day. Bye.